Hey everyone, Pradeep here from TGT and welcome to another video and in this video I am going to show you the step by step process of how to lock any app on your iPhone. Neither I am asking you to install Cydia and jailbreak your device nor I am asking you to install any third party app or buy any third party app from the app store. The process I am going to tell you is completely inbuilt within the iOS itself. You have to be on any version of iOS 14 or any version of iOS 15 beta to try this one out. I'll be demonstrating this one using an iPhone 10 or running iOS 15 developer beta 5. Now before I start, here is a request to subscribe to my channel. Please subscribe to TGT and please don't skip any of the steps I am going to show you. So please don't skip this video. Each and every step is important here. So let's get started. Here is the iPhone 10R I am talking about. This one is running iOS 15 developer beta 5. Let's check that about. As you can see, this one is running the developer beta 5 of iOS 15. Now close this one and you have to open the shortcut app first. In this app, you can see that there is an automation option right here. Tap this one and you will be able to see the automation that you have already created. I already have an automation here, but if you do not have any automation here, you will see nothing. Just tap the plus and here the menu will ask for two options, create personal automation or create home automation. We will tap the create personal automation and then in this menu scroll down and find the app option within this app option you can see that this page has two different selections one is is opened and the other one is is closed keep that in is opened position and then from this option select the apps you want to lock that means you want to put the lock on this selected app so you have to select the apps you want to use the locks here then uh, select the choose option and say we are locking the camera the calculator you can select any app as you can see here all the apps that has been installed is visible here then say we want to lock uh, this uh, Instagram then the messages and photos okay app selected this app then select done here you can see that any of five apps that means we have selected five apps here you can add or delete any apps from this list later as well now after that click next and here you can see that there is an option called add action tap on add action and from here select the timer As you can see, we have the start timer option now. Now click on the start timer option and in this menu, in the start timer for change this to the seconds option and here you have to put at least one. If you put zero, the automation will fail. It will not run. So you have to select one at least and change it to the seconds and then click next. Here you can see there is an option and it also says that ask before running and you have to disable this one. That means we don't want it to ask before running the automation. So disable this one and then click done. Now you can see that we have created another automation here. Now the process from this level is complete. We will exit this one and what you have to do then we have to go to the world clock app and in this clock app we have to select the timer option in this timer you have to select the one second the second you have provided there have to be same in here as well so we will select the one second option and then we will just pick just click the start now as you can see the phone is locked and then it is unlocked using my face id now do one thing stop this one go out of this and then select any of the apps that we have created locked for say the photos you can see it shows the photos for a second and then it disappears 
so it is being locked and it will be only unlocked via your face id now let's check for the calculator as you can see it's now disabled now select the instagram option as well as you can see the instagram is open and it is being closed immediately by those app lockers so all the apps you have selected is now has been locked using your face id but you can see one annoying thing here every time you choose this option there is an intimation or a notification about the running of the automation this may be very much annoying so we can disable this one as well for that go to settings then go to screen time here select the see all activity and at the very bottom you will be able to see notifications and then the shortcuts what you have to do just go back to the previous date and then come back to the current date and here you can see that you can select the shortcut option now what you have to do just disable the allow notification option and get out of here and now try again see there is no notifications so that annoying notification is now gone let's try the instagram as you can see it's now locked so the annoying notification option is now gone and you can enable this for any app that you have installed on this device so i hope this video is helpful to you if it is please like this and share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to tgt i'll see you in my next one peace